But let's Thank start you. first of all with your your pyramid because this is sort of the foundation isn't it yeah so this is a tool that i've created for my new book i mean at this time of year everybody's starting to think about weight loss and bikini diets and as you know i'm all about healthy weight loss not about starving yourselves that's not the, that's so not the way to do it meals not at all in fact the best way to lose weight is to eat the right things and so that's why i created this pyramid to give people an idea of the just the amount of food that you can actually eat in a day okay so where do you be begin healthy. so this is a day this is what i this can is eat a day. whole day right so at the bottom we've got our fluids because a lot of people forget to keep themselves hydrated so that can be herbal teas teas coffees and some water and then we've got our fruits and vegetables because about three quarters of people in the uk don't actually achieve the right amount of vegetables per day uh, fruits and vegetables and so it's five pieces of fruit and veg no you've so got we've more got there. three fruits and six portions of vegetables so we're trying to achieve the the new recommendations and when people look at this now if you're watching this at home is that can i have three apples no <laughs> uh... just an apple so it's one portion of fruit so it's this one is just thing as an example picture, right? yeah okay. one portion of fruit then we've got our proteins because people often skip on proteins and they always think that proteins are just animal meats but actually you can have eggs you can have pulses nuts and seeds but making sure that we get our proteins is the best way to keep us feeling full okay. um for people that aren't necessarily trying to lose weight or are really active so in the gym we need a little bit of starchy carbohydrate so that's the good quality carbohydrates like brown rice and good uh, wholemeal bread. And then the fats, that's what a lot of people still skip because they're thinking that fats make them fat, which mm. we know is not true. So things like olive oil and avocado, they're a great source of so healthy fats. you can still fats. cook with olive oil, you can absolutely. still put olive oil on your salads, you can yeah. drizzle it over things and that's all absolutely fine. It's all really good stuff. Okay. And then I've got a portion of nuts and seeds at the top because, again, it's a great way of getting essential fats and, and good omega, uh, omegas, acid, fatty acids into and the diet. And so these are, these, well, you'll put these into three portions, uh, three meals a day exactly what about in between am i allowed to go and have a snack here and there the or? idea is that if you're eating sensibly at three meals you don't really need to be snacking and these if you're eating sensibly and having lots of fruits and vegetables and good proteins you shouldn't be getting hungry and needing yeah, to snack because the thing is we i think what most of us will find if we go oh i just need something sweet and yes. i can't see something sweet on there so what happens well, if you feel like you need that or is that just habit it's just habit usually holly and it only takes about five days to change that but you, you are getting some sugars from the fruits and actually you're getting some sugars from the carbohydrates of the vegetables. Well, if you put that uh, off the cardboard and onto the table, it starts to look like this. this is that what looks a day beautiful. Could look like. So that's breakfast. That's breakfast. With but not all of got... that. Yeah, you can eat all of that. No way. Yeah. And if I don't eat it all for breakfast, can I save then it up and have it later? you can save some for lunch, exactly. Oh, OK. And then we've got some chicken pate, which I've quickly made up to have a lettuce instead of a sandwich, and then some salmon for supper. So it's just to give people an idea of, actually, this is how much food you can eat if you're wanting to lose weight. It's Wait, not about eating really less, good. it's eating right. I mean, you're not going to go hungry, are you? That's exactly, gorgeous. which is That's the point. That's really lovely. OK. And you see, the thing is also, it's not screaming, I'm healthy, No, Abby, it doesn't look quite healthy. Interesting. Looks so naughty. pleased you think that, Philip.